When you've been a golf cart dealer for more than a decade, you're in the perfect situation to become a golf cart manufacturer. Golf Carting TV is your inside source for the coolest upgrades, mods, and accessories to take your trusty golf cart from drab to fab. Hey there, welcome back to Golf Carting TV. My name is Matt with Converted Carts, and we're thrilled to have you back for another episode of Golf Carting TV. Today, we've got a brand spotlight, and we are talking with the folks at Voyager EV. And there are a lot of brands coming out, but as I had this conversation with these guys, there was really something special about what they have going on. So they started actually as a golf cart dealer. And so going through that process, they learned a whole bunch and then have kind of taken what they've learned and the problems and challenges that they faced through that process in order to create a uh, manufactured brand, an actual golf cart itself, that as that company deals with dealers and then with the consumer in mind, they really have a different way of approaching dealer support, dealer feedback, product innovation, all that kind of stuff. So I'm excited. It was great to talk to these guys. It's a team of like best friends who came together to form a company. And so they've got a great story. So let's go ahead and jump in and learn more about Voyager EV. My name is Andy Ilg, and I have Ashley here and Mary Clarice uh, Hathaway. And uh, yeah, we're with Voyager Electric Vehicles down here in Peachtree City, Georgia. Tell me a little bit about uh, just kind of the start of Voyager EV. What what made you get into this business? I, I believe there's some history there. So show me a little bit about uh, some of the history and, and we'll kind of go from there. Yeah, Voyager EV started officially back in the fall of 2022. And um, it really just came out of a need. We realized um, Andy and I have owned a golf cart dealership here in town for about 13 years now. And we realized, um, like a lot of dealerships did post-COVID, post-pandemic, um, that there was a huge need for not just quality inventory, but also a ton of dealer support. And so um, seeing that experience firsthand and just realizing there's a, there's a better way to do this. Um, and with Andy's background, um, he is a, an aerospace engineer rocket scientist, we like to say, I mean, it is, he is a rocket scientist. So we like to um, say, you know, our carts are rocket scientist approved, but with his capabilities and experience and uh, relationships he's built over decades, um, it, we knew it was the right time to move forward on something that could not just help our industry, um, not just help our dealership, but help the industry as a whole. And so we shook hands with our best friends, Jeff and Mary Clarice Hathaway, her son, Lucas Hathaway, um, and the, the golf cart business came to life and we've never looked back. That's awesome. So what I love to see obviously is just, uh, as a small business owner myself and, and seeing business owners and, and starting in situations like that. Um, can you tell me just a little bit about maybe some of the challenges that you've had maybe in the transition from golf cart dealer to golf cart manufacturer and just kind of walk through a little bit of what you've been through in order to, to make that a reality? All right. So yeah, no, great, great question. And uh, yeah, basically uh, about 13 years ago, we started a retail golf cart store in Peachtree City. Uh, I started it in my home garage and, uh, you know, just that found different uh, things that caught on in my town that, that uh, you know, customizations and high performance capabilities of golf carts and, you know, different, different things that made the golf cart unique. And so over the years, um, as we've been in the industry, we've brought on a lot of different brands, you know, but coming from the aerospace, you know, it just made me, you know, think of a lot of these gaps. And some of these gaps are quality control and customer support. And, uh, you know, and then, and then in our industry is in a timely manner. It's important that you fix these carts quickly, you get parts quickly, so on and so forth. So your customers as happy as they possibly can be. We decided as a group to partner together and work together on this project. And I'm so glad we did because, uh, you know, we've been in business about two years now. And, and over the two years, we've, we've solved so many different things, you know, um, systems and customer support and part inventory. And, uh, you know, we just, we've, we've come to, to fall in love with the system that we were, we were hoping to, to basically design. And so now that we, we have that, 
Um, this PGA show, this last, you know, just our past PGA show, um, you know, we launched our brand new Patriot golf cart and, uh, you know, which you'll get to see here in a second, but the Patriot golf cart, uh, is our, is, is one of the models we offer. We offer several different models, but each model solves something else for our dealer. You know, some of it is aluminum framing. Some of it is a price point. Some of it are features. So, you know, so we solve within our inventory and our, and our offering um, everything that a dealership could, could ask for. You know, hey, I need a budget-friendly golf cart. We've got it. Hey, I need an aluminum frame because I'm in salty conditions. We've got it. But it's not just having the product, but it's being able to call and get someone real on the phone that, that can help walk you through, uh, you know, even troubleshooting or, hey, help me understand this, this, and this, you know, and we're here as a team doing that for our dealer network. Whereas our team, if we spend the time and we interview a dealer to bring a dealer on board, we're taking the time to know them as a person, to know them as, 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 a, as a family, like what do they want to achieve? And, and Jeff Hathaway, I, and it's so cool watching Jeff do this, but Jeff will, will pick up the phone and, and he comes from, uh, he's a, he used to be a general manager of a car dealership and he'll literally help take dealers that we have on board and he'll help solve their sales hiccups, if you will. If they don't know how to, how to market or offer promotions or how to how you know, different uh, sales techniques, you know, coming from that industry. And he'll literally spend his time, his effort, his energy, he'll fly out to dealers. He'll, you know, he'll do these different things that, to help our dealers instead of saying, hey, you're not meeting our goal, see you later. So um, yeah, our goal is to make sure that uh, our, our dealer network that we spend the time to interview and bring on, it, uh, you're with us for the long haul, you know, and that we can be with you for the long haul. There's a couple of things that I heard in there that, that kind of make you stand out, I believe. One is obviously having the golf cart dealership experience. So you know the pains and the troubles and the, and the issues and struggles that a, that a golf cart dealer has dealt with. But then also you mentioned the, the car dealership side of things, which is a completely different and yet very similar um, world as far as all the details and, and stuff that comes in there. So I, it sounds like you guys look at the business from not just a, you know, we're making this for a consumer, but you're truly building the business around this end result as a consumer, but we want that dealer experience to be fantastic as well. And I think that is a win-win for both dealer and consumer. And then ultimately, obviously, that makes uh, good for you guys as well. Yes, absolutely. You know, maybe tell me what you're trying to create as far as the, the feeling and the brand and the tone around uh, Voyager EV and, and maybe why you chose that. Like, you know, what was the, what was some of the thinking behind that? I think, you know, overall, you know, when you look at Andy and Ash and my husband, Jeff and I, and Lucas, and the way we've kind of lived our life, it really has kind of been against the grain. You know, entrepreneurship, you know, at its core is typically against the grain of, you know, what most people do. You have to be a risk taker. You have to be willing to get out there and, and kind of put yourself on the line and get out of your comfort zone and do all these things. The adventure. And, yeah. and that's really what we wanted our brand to reflect is like, how do you approach life? You know, Ash has heard me say this probably a million times, but I love an adventure. Like go somewhere, get lost, figure it out. And we wanted the brand and our product to reflect adventure, going against the grain, doing something different because we wanted to interrupt the golf cart industry. You know, we wanted to be industry disruptors. We wanted to change the game a little bit. And we didn't want it just to be about the product. We wanted it to be about the team behind the product. You know, because you can have an amazing product. And, I, and Andy's touched on some of this, but you can have an incredible product. But we wanted people to know us, to know the team and know what they're getting. They're not just getting a great golf cart. They're getting a team of people behind it that like we're all in. So, so Ashley, I know we, we ran into each other at the, at the PGA show and, and I know you guys, this was kind of a first big intro there. So tell me a little bit about what, you know, as, as, uh, was just kind of explained as to why the brand and kind of this adventure mentality and stuff, what were some of the things that you were hearing? I know you said that you guys had a great showing down there and a lot of great feedback, but what, how did people respond to that, that kind of message that you're trying to put out there? Yeah, absolutely. It was an incredible, um, 
experience there, such great feedback, and it really solidified exactly what Mary Clarice was just saying. People resonate with the idea of not just finding adventure, but in an industry that's gotten very overcrowded really quickly, uh, dealers everywhere are looking for a lane that they can own, a lane that they can drive down, a lane that they can um, pursue something different than maybe the dealers next door. And when we give them a story and a brand and a product that um, comes with that story that they're ready to own and that they're looking for, um, and a team that really stands behind that why and that belief, um, it resonated so well. And so we overwhelmingly heard, you know, like, like you guys are a breath of fresh air. You know, you guys are what we've been looking for. Like, oh my gosh, thank you for solving, you know, specifically the dealer support situation. You know, um, thank you for taking seriously the fact that we are all business owners, we are all winning, um, and we're all looking for a better way to do it. And so it was really encouraging, um, just over and over again, hearing so many dealers just excited, not just to bring on the product, because it's an incredible product, but to be able to shake hands with us and say, let's do business together. You guys are doing exactly what we want to do. You sound just like us. Um, it was it was incredibly um, encouraging. Yeah. Yeah, that's great. I think that entrepreneurial uh, mentality that you both just talked about, I think, you know, I talk to dealers all the time and you know, one of the main things that does come out there is, especially when they're going with a new brand, is yeah. I have no idea, you know, how long this is going to last. I have no idea how I'm going to get parts. I have no idea, you know, what's going to be the the service uh, side of things, how well that's going to run, because I'm just seeing a cart for the first time or hearing, you know, hearing about a brand for the first time. So I think it's great that you are approaching it as business owners yourself and then addressing that whole kind of dealer concern uh, mm -hmm. before they before they ask it or before they have to deal with it, you're thinking about that stuff. And it sounds like that's, you know, as Andy was talking about before, about how you're building the businesses around that, that whole concept, which is very cool. Yeah, right. Yeah, we're definitely in this for the long game. So we want to help dealers from the start with the end in mind. And so um, if we can help our dealers win first, we know that we'll eventually win too. Awesome. Well, why don't we uh, jump into a couple of the, uh, the carts that you have there and let's, let's maybe take a look around and, Tell us a little bit about some different variations of what you got. So let's let's go ahead and start talking about the, the Voyager Patriot. The Patriot is our 2024 model, and right here is one of our Voyager Patriots. This is our all aluminum model, which we are offering for you know places like Florida, places in salty conditions, um, or you know even if you're just looking for something that's a little bit lighter. Um, this, this machine is fantastic. So it's a, it's a 48 volt uh, system golf cart with a five kilowatt AC driven motor. And uh, it is all lithium powered. The lithium power in, in our industry is, is such a huge thing. Uh, the zero maintenance, the, the longer warranties, uh, the faster charge times. So we, we've chosen all lithium powered. If you look at our stitching on our seats, we do, uh, you know, we came up with a, um, we really wanted a premium seat option. And so we, we did a nice contoured uh, bucket uh, driven seat here with the unique stitching that matches the golf cart. And, uh, you know, just gives it a very, very warm uh, feel. And, and it's absolutely amazingly comfortable to sit in. Um, if you, if you kind of walk around the golf cart a little bit, we, we have roof handles on everything. We've got uh, a rear flip down seat kit. This rear flip down seat kit does give you access to uh, a storage trunk. The storage trunk we, is removable and, uh, you know, gives you more access to different kinds of storage. We also have uh, DOT rated seat belts uh, on all of our models. This, this comes standard here on the Patriot. And then you'll just see on the dash here, the dash is incredible. You know, we did a, uh, this is an 11.5 LCD multimedia display. Um, the multimedia display gives us uh, Apple CarPlay, Android Connect. Um, it's just a, a beautiful display system, also giving us reverse camera and radio functions. So if you look at the rest of the dash here, we've got locking glove boxes uh, standard on the, the golf cart. And um, you've got these cup holders here, which are nice and deep, perfect for, you know, big size milkshakes, as I like to call them. Uh, and then looking at the floorboard, the floorboard is an all aluminum. 
with a, uh, you know, kind of coming back to the six and a half inch Marine speaker. Uh, these sound amazing. The, the Marine speakers are incredible. They're water resistant, of course. And then coming back to the front, as I turned it on, you're going to see we have a really cool looking LED front end with the Voyager emblem in it. Uh, you have uh, a, a double A-arm suspension system, which gives you camber adjustment and uh, an absolutely incredibly smooth ride. So this is just uh, you know one of our models, and uh, we're, we're so excited for the 2024 launch here. That's so, very cool. And you have a couple different options of that as far as seat seats uh, set up and things like that? Yes. Yeah. So thank you for that question. Yeah, we offer this model in a four passenger lifted, non-lifted. We also offer it in a four forward design and we offer it in a six seater lifted and non-lifted. And yes, uh, to answer your question about the seats, if you look, we are offering a couple different seats on the Patriot version. We will have a white seating option uh, with the matching stitching. And uh, yeah, we have a couple different options on our, on our seats, but the same type of a concept with the, uh, the stitching and the design and all that stuff. But yeah, multiple colors. Tell me a little bit about some of the, your, your other models. And again, mention the names. So I think the name's very cool and kind of come across with that. Uh, like I said, they kind of each have their own a little attitude, I think, which is cool. Yeah, absolutely. Okay, so we'll do the Rebel. So this is the Voyager Rebel. Um, this, we call it the Juggernaut, is um, uh, just the, the beast. You know, it comes only in lifted, a four-seater or six-seater. This one here, obviously, is our six-seater lifted. Um, and the, the standout feature on this Rebel is the 72-volt lithium. Um, so you get tons of power with it. Of course, you get the same premium screen with the media player and all the Apple CarPlay options, um, like you did on the Patriot. Your custom steering wheel and all the dash features. This one has the solid black seats, of course, with all the, the super cushiony um, upholstery. And then you get a nice 14-inch all-terrain wheel package. Nice. You mentioned Juggernaut. It, it does, you know, when I looked at that in, uh, at the show and online, it, you know, it definitely it's like a beast. I mean, it, it said it looks like it's 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 got some, some substance to it, I guess you yeah, could say. Absolutely. It's very cool. Yeah. So it's got all the bells and whistles, everything you need. Nice growly look, nice growly personality. Um, and so it's kind of designed for the people that looking looking for that adventure that's never ending and over all the hills, over all the terrain. Um, so yeah, that's the Rebel, that's the 72 volt. And then we also have the Explorer, which we do not have one right here, but um, it has the same body style as our Pioneer. Um, and again, with all the bells and whistles, and it comes in the non-lifted, the lifted, for the four and the six passenger, and the four forward facing. So the Explorer and the Patriot are um, very comparable. Um, the difference between those is one, the Patriot is the aluminum frame and the Explorer is non-aluminum. Um, other than that, they're very, very similar um, in all their features. The body style is different as well, of course, too. Um, and then this is our Pioneer. So this is our 48 volt, of course, lithium powered, everything you need. Um, the goal and the, the spot, the lane for the Pioneer is that it's an under $10,000 cart with everything you need. Um, we did not cut any corners, so you've still got um, your nice 12-inch wheel package with a nice tall tread, so it's a very comfortable ride. You still have your four hydraulic disc brakes um, and our active brake parking brake. Um, we've got your lithium power, of course, beautiful um, dashboard here with all your cup holders, um, beautiful steering wheel and your side mirrors, the plush seating with the matching stitching. And of course, all of our 12 colors are available for this one as well. So the Pioneer is a great entry level um, for any dealer looking to hit that under $10,000 mark for their customers. Yeah, and I see on each of those, so I see the mirrors with the blinkers and things like that. So I'm assuming each one of these is uh, has light packages and you know basically all the things that are needed for those that have street legal uh, rules and things like that. Absolutely. Yep. Turn signals, horn, brake lights, um, projector lights, they're all on all of the models. 
Awesome. Well, this is so cool, guys. I really appreciate you taking the time and and uh, sharing, you know, what you guys have as a vision and the product and the company itself is just uh, it really is cool and and sounds like there's some some good good things happening there. Why don't you tell uh, us a little bit just about how to find you, website, social medias? What's the best way for somebody to get in touch, whether they're a dealer or if they're a consumer and they love you know what they've heard and they want to reach out and find a cart? Uh, tell us how we can find you. Yep, so you can find us on Instagram at Voyager Electric Vehicles. Our website is voyagerelectricvehicles.com, where we have all of our contact information for dealers, for consumers. We'll help connect you to a local dealer. Um, But yeah, we've got um, account managers and our great staff waiting, standing by to, um, you know, connect and help answer any questions and get you any resources. And um, we'd love to, we'd love to meet up. One of my favorite things about what they have going on down there uh, with Voyager is just the whole theme, the whole concept around the Voyager name. And then you've got names like uh, Patriot and Rebel and things that are just, it's kind of all, they've got a bit of an attitude uh, about breaking the rules and doing things differently and stuff. So uh, I, I hope you enjoyed that and I hope you learned some good stuff there. But if you are looking for a cart or if you're a dealer and you're looking for uh, a brand to carry, definitely reach out to the folks at Voyager EV and they'd be thrilled to talk with you and uh, help you through that process. So like, subscribe, share, do what you can, put this out there and uh, we'll see you back here next Wednesday at noon every week. A new episode drops.